Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Mountain Blade Warband. In the last episode, we were able to defend our keep and we were able to uh, manage to uh, make peace with the Kingdom of Swadia. And uh, what we're planning to do now is to uh, continue to fortify. Um, but since we are at peace with the Kingdom of Swadia, we can go over here now and we can check uh, those cities to see if they have any uh, nice soldiers for us to, to hire. Right now, I'm just going to go to the marketplace here. Actually, I do want to see if I can get a better horse and a stubborn cursor. Well, his speed is 50. That was what I was wanting. Just a faster horse. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh, it won't cost too much for that. So we got our horse and let's see if we can go to um, the Kingdom of Swadia and see if they have anything. All right. So we made it to the Kingdom of Swadia and uh, oh, oh, people want to fight. People want to fight. Looks like we're getting attacked by some bandits. All right. <laughs> that dude's running away. He's running away too. Oh, come on. Oop, get juked. Get juked. Come on, who else? Oh, get blocked. Come on. Come on. Just, just you and me, dude. Now, where's your friend? There you are. Yep, it's just you, man. I killed two of your friends. How do you feel? Ooh, yeah. You stabbed me and I took zero damage. Well then, well at least we got 150 dinars, um, so it looks like somebody wanted to assassinate us, which doesn't surprise me. We're going to, you know, we're going to the Kingdom of Swadia and we just made peace with them, so they're probably still a little mad. Ooh, but they do have this nice shield. This is what I was looking for, a, husk a, a Huskler's shield. Um, they're pretty big, so if you look, you can see the difference of how ginormous this shield is. Uh, so I think I was going to take that. Yeah, I'll go ahead and buy that. Alright, we're here at Suno. I keep doing that. Uh, but let's see if we can... Oh, they have some hired blades. I will definitely take them. Visiting the tavern here at Praven, Mercenary Cavalryman. You guys are expensive, but yeah, I'll take you guys. I think this dude is like an engineering. Is it, He's an engineer. I don't know if I want to take him or not. You know what, I think we are going to wind up taking this guy because engineering is a party skill, which means that it's everybody's uh, collective skills uh, all together. So I think I'm going to go ahead and get this guy, but yeah, he is going to get paid up front. Uh, so 300 dinars is no problem. We'll go ahead and pay that guy. Let's go ahead and go back to the Kingdom of Rodox. Like I said, I do believe the Kingdom of Rodox are going to declare war on us pretty soon. Um, if they don't, then I'll go ahead and start a war so that I can... Um, go ahead and start claiming this part of the map let's see do they have crossbowmen or yeah crossbowmen let's take those guys the, the, the watchmen turn into these guys so um i didn't want to have to level up the watchmen but we got we got what we wanted let's go to jelkala before we head home all right in jelkala who do you guys have mercenary swordsman i'll take you guys you guys are pretty good oh look who we found while we were out looking for more uh, people to hire, we found Jeremus, who is the surgeon. Let is, let's totally get this guy. And we have our money now, so we have 6,000 dinars. We have a lot more money to spend on soldiers. Alright, after a few days of uh, running around to all these separate towns, we managed to build our garrison up to 200 soldiers, and as you can see, we have 54 crossbowmen, 51 hired blades, 57 cavalry, so we are looking pretty good on that front. Oh, look what happened. Kingdom fails to respond. The Kingdom of Rodox has not responded to the Kingdom of Halstein's provocations, and King Groveth suffers a loss of face among his more bellicose subjects. So I'm assuming this happened because the Kingdom of Rodox did not go to war with us over that situation with Emmer. So I'm assuming because the king didn't go to war with us, now the, the people of Rodox are unhappy with their king. So let's just see if this sparks a war um, like I think it will. Oh, it finally happened. A declaration of war. The Kingdom of Rodox has declared war against the Kingdom of Halstein. Uh, so it's a good thing that we've been stocking up on soldiers because we're about to use them. And just like that, they already started attacking our town. Let's get to our garrison and let's load up. Alright, so they were attacking Ammer. We have about 50 um, cavalrymen and about 20 hired blades. Let's go and see if we can take care of these guys. 
All right, let's fight this dude. We have 134 against their 39. I'm assuming that's because we have like the farmers from the village helping out, which is actually uh, kind of a nuisance. But uh, I believe we can totally win this, no problem. Where are these guys at? Oh, here they are on the right. On the right, men. I'm gonna get these crossbowmen because they are the biggest problem. Boom. All right. Clean these guys up. These guys are nothing. I want to get off this horse. I can properly help. Come on. You guys are easy. Uh. Now, if you don't know, the Kingdom of Rodox, they specialize in spearmen and crossbowmen. So that's what they have a lot of. So that's going to be really hard to take to take their towns, actually, because most of our guys are going to get mowed down. Oh, we had a farmer die. Oh, let's get this sergeant right here. Oh, here's the Lord. Oh, come on. I want the Lord. Oh, I'll just kill the sergeant. I want the Lord. Move, move, move. I want this guy. Oh, come on. Oh, somebody else got him. And we defended our village. Sweet. Oh, no. This is being raided. Oh, that's being raided too. Everything is being raided. We're gonna have to fight these guys off. You are going to die, dude. You are going to die. Come on, man. For our villages. Uh, death from above. Oh, I got him. All right, come at me, come at me, bros. I'll take on all of you. Come on! Let's get these guys. These guys are not really bred for combat. They're, they're bred for uh, turtling, essentially. Oh, oh, oh. Get this guy. Kill him. Another victory. Now let's hurry on over to Fender. Yep, you're my prisoner. Peace agreement. The Kingdom of Nords. All right, peace with Kingdom of Swadia. Oh my gosh. Uh, Fender, I'm sorry. Uh, you're gone. You are you are dead, Fender. I am so sorry. We cannot help you. Um, this is bad. This is really bad. I know. I know Fender's. I guess I know Fender's being attacked. But there's nothing we can do about that. There's not one single thing we can do. I, I don't know what to do. That's a massive army right there. This is this is the, this is what I thought we were gonna run into with the kingdom of uh, Swadia. But look at this. It's, it's, it's they've already looted that. And now they're gonna come for this town. If we can pick off like one or two of these, that'd be cool. Oh no, we're just gonna lead them straight to this town. Oh my gosh, we're getting pincered. Oh no. Come on over here. We need to go to our town. We're gonna go to the garrison. Let's throw everybody in. Let's throw everybody in. Let's uh, level up. I'm gonna go to charisma just because we need more. We need more soldiers, and that's all we need. Uh, I'm gonna put throw this in engineering, and uh, throw this in crossbows, and then throw, I don't know whatever. Now what I'm gonna do next is. I'm gonna go leave, but I'm not gonna do anything. I'm just gonna go to the inventory. I'm gonna switch our lance for our our hunting crossbow. Wait, do we have any better crossbows? 37, 44, 46. We'll we'll take this one. We have food, and I'm going to. Uh, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this because we need our sword. But you know, if we're getting sieged, then we don't need it. And uh, I'm just going to do this right here. So. What this is going to allow us to do is we're going to have a whole bunch of bolts and we're going to have our our big weapon and if they try to seize us we're going to try to protect ourselves all right we're we're gonna have the turtle we are going to have to wait for some time because they're going to siege us i bet i think they're going to siege us okay so count telrog with king rocks is laying waste to ever yeah well we can't do anything about the oh and they went right by us so we're, we're, I hate to, I hate to do this, but we're just gonna have to chill. We're just gonna have to let them take everything that they want from our little towns. 
because we can't do anything about that. And if we leave, if we leave, yeah, they've, yeah, they've raided Emmer. If we leave our town to go raid one of their towns, they're probably going to, uh, yeah, they're gonna, and that's, and that's the other town. They will give us 2600 for this other dude. Yeah, sure. The only reason why I gave them back that guy is because it's well, number one for money, but number two, if we don't, then you lose honor. Honor, uh, you need honor to promote yourself to be the king of the entire uh, country eventually. Um, so yeah, they're just they're laying waste to all of our towns. Maybe we can go to the garrison and let's take our let's take all of our cavalrymen and let's just peek over there see if we can stop this from happening. No, that no, we can't we can't stop that from happening. It's way too much. Ugh, I hate this. We're just helpless. All we can do, all we can do, is sit here, twiddle our thumbs, and wait for them to attack us, our main city. If they don't attack our main city, then we can't do anything. So at least we're getting, we got some money. Oh, are they gonna are they gonna raid us? Can we get these guys? Oh no, we cannot. Oh no, we cannot. Ugh, I hate this. We're so we're so powerless. We can't do anything. All of our town, all of our little towns are looted. All we can do is just wait here. I don't think that they w they are that they are gonna seize this. Although they 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 totally they totally should. I think we would still win just because we have the walls. But I don't know if they would actually do that. We can we can actually take these guys on. All right, let's fight this guy. Got the, got the leader. Oh, so, like in an open field like this, like in an open battle like this, these guys do not stand a chance. But once we, once you put these guys on walls, these guys are going to be almost impenetrable. Look, look, we're just like, we're mopping up these guys. We, we just destroyed them. But like I said, you put them on the wall where we have to run to their arrows. Yeah, it's bad news. All right, we got this guy. Let's fight him. He's got a lot of soldiers. Uh. Oh, I hit him. Come on. Got him. Got the Lord. All right. Come on. Mop up crew. Let's do it. These guys destroyed our villages. Uh. All right, another battle won. All right, let's see if we can capture this little village right here. Let's see if, if we get in trouble for doing this. Well, they ran away from us. Those guys ran away from us. Oh, this guy's coming in. We will fight. Oh, we're fighting the king. Oh, he has a lot of soldiers. Let's see if we can do this. Oh, we need to get off the horse. We need to get off the horse. It's hurting us to get on the horse. Alright. Come on. Come on. Yes. Come on. Get these guys. They're easy. Get them from the back. I'll just kill the sergeant. One. Oh, we had a cover in the die. Uh, level up. Cool. Come here, Sergeant. Get these guys from the back. Oh, no. Just keep chopping. Keep chopping. Oh, get off me. 
Oh, that's my guy. Keep chopping. Oh. Oh, get out of here, dude. Get out of here, dude. I got you. I suppose that's your blood or their blood. Oh. Oh my gosh. Look at this. How did we win? Oh, no, it's just that was just the first wave. Now it's going in for the second wave. Alright, let's go, men. Oh, they yeah, completely are these, these crossbowmen. Although, most of them are crossbowmen, to be fair. Uh, come on. How am I missing? Alright, we're gonna get off the horse again. Don't kill my horse. Oh, come on. Oh, I got him, guys. Don't worry about it. Alright, oh. Come on. Get through these guys. Alright, who's left? Oh, who's got behind me? Oh, this chaos, I can't see. Where's the last guy at? Where's the last guy at? Oh, there's one guy right here. Get him. Second wave, much easier. Much easier than second wave. And we won. We won. That is incredible. And we were able to get that. Like I said, these guys are very weak on the ground. You guys, you, if you put them... On towers, these guys are really hard to kill. I saw that we had enemy patrols near here. Doesn't look like there's anybody here, though. Who this guy has 93 people? He has a lot of spearmen, but he doesn't have a lot of crossbowmen. I think we can take him. This is the guy that has 90-some-odd people. Let's hope we win this fight. He has 20 or so more soldiers than us, but like I said, these guys are very squishy. So I think we should be fine. Alright, these guys are really close too. Get them, men. They have recruits. This should be easy. He just has a whole bunch of recruits. Come on. Get, no, I want him. I want him. Come on. I want you so. I want you. Oh, come on. Oh, I got him. I got him. I did it. Alright. They got reinforcements. Charge! Get off the horse. Get off the horse. Get off the horse. Oh no. Oh, come on. Let's get these guys. No, we lost the man. Where's everybody else at? Ooh. We won. Ooh. And this is what happens when we can't get all of our money from our little villages. We barely get anything out of that. Alright, Amber is currently being raided right now. This guy thinks he can fight us? I'm not sure why. Alright, let's kill these guys. Alright, dude. Let's kill them. So many of them. With one spot. Just gonna keep swinging. That was easy. Alright, while our villages are safe, let's go ahead and loot this village again. 
Oh, this guy came to stop us. That's fine. We will fight you. Yeah, you have like twice as many soldiers as this, but I'm sure that's mostly farmers as per usual. Go over here. Let's get these guys to get off my horse. Come on now. Oh, there you are. I see you. You can't hide in a group of farmers, dude. Alright, get ready for the second wave to come in, man. So many people. So many. Alright, is that the second wave? Get my way. Oh, here's a second wave! Ugh. Help, man! Oh, swingy, feverishly. Oh, oh we lost the man. Oh, come on. Let's get in there. What are you doing? Kill him. Somebody kill him. I'll do it. Can't see. Sorry, right, farmer. That's the last guy I was over here. Last few guys. Well, was that just wave one or was that everybody? That was wave one. Alright, this this next wave should be a lot easier. Let's go around. Don't block me, dude. Oh, spell. Oh, no. Let's get these guys over here. Come on. Focus on me, not on my men. Whoa. Lost another man. Uh. Other people are left. Come on, kill them. There we go. Alright guys, so we've defended all of our villages, and all of them are safe for, as of now. Um, we have 84 in our party, and we have 158 in our garrison. We are losing soldiers uh, you know, here and there, so we are going to have to replenish them. Luckily, we found the surgeon, and he's keeping most of our soldiers alive. Um, I'm finding that fighting the Rodox is actually harder than I thought, because I don't think I can take any towns. Um, maybe uh, we can try... Uh, taking some of these towns uh, here in a little bit once I can once I can carry about a hundred people I think we'll be able uh, to take a, a rather a town or a castle but I don't think I can do that uh, with 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 anything less just because the sheer amount of people that they have in these castles I also wanted to mention that uh, I haven't showed you guys at half the battles that I had but there's just so many there was a, there's at least a dozen battles that I've fought but I didn't find whether to be too interesting or to be compelling enough to show you guys but we went back and forth patrolling our town for almost an hour and we've killed a lot of people we've lost some people and honestly it's been a long drawn out bloody battle with the kingdom of Rodox. Well, while the war still rages on with the Kingdom of Rodox, I think that's going to be it for this episode. If you enjoyed this episode and want to show your support, you can do that by leaving a comment and stabbing that like button if you so choose to. If you're new here or a returning viewer, I encourage you to subscribe if you haven't already. Until next time, I'm Brader Wonder, and I'll catch you all later.